Chinese CEOs continue to criticize Tesla CEO Elon Musk for some of his decisions. A month ago, we discussed CATL's CEO pointing out what he believed to be Musk's flawed choice in using cylindrical cells for Tesla batteries. And now we have the CEO of Li Auto, who is called Li Xiang, who has added his voice to the mix, questioning Musk's decision to abandon LiDAR in favor of a camera-based approach for autonomous driving. It's fascinating to see these remarks, especially as they highlight how China is pulling ahead of the US in many aspects of electric vehicle technology. But are they right in their critiques? Let's break it down. And I would like to hear your opinion on the same, even if you're using 11 labs for voice generation. Li Xiang recently addressed this issue at an AI talk event, defending his company's choice to use LiDAR in its vehicles. According to him, the driving conditions in China are significantly different from those in the US. And those differences demand a more robust approach to safety. He pointed out that highways in China, particularly at night, can be dangerous, with broken down trucks often left parked in unlit areas. He went on to argue that while Tesla's cameras might see objects a little over 100 meters away in low light conditions, LiDAR extends that range to 200 meters, providing critical reaction time for avoiding hazards. Li Auto's use of LiDAR enables advanced safety features like automatic emergency braking, AEB, at speeds of up to 130 kilometers per hour. And he emphasized that his company prioritizes family safety, which is why they continue to include LiDAR in their vehicles and plan to do so in future models. While Musk has repeatedly dismissed LiDAR as unnecessary and expensive, but hey, Chinese models with LiDAR are far cheaper than any Tesla car. Tesla's approach to autonomous driving relies on a pure vision system, with cameras and neural networks mimicking human perception. Grace Tao, who is Tesla's Vice President of External Affairs, recently reiterated this stance, explaining that roads and traffic systems are designed for human vision, making cameras the most natural solution for autonomous driving. Tesla argues that adding LiDAR or radar could confuse the system and unnecessarily inflate vehicle costs. What is interesting to note from China is that Xpeng has recently decided to remove LiDAR from some of its new models, including the P7 Plus sedan and upcoming SUV facelifts. In this case, Xpeng's shift seems more about cost-cutting and streamlining production than a fundamental disagreement about the technology's value. What's your take on this? Do you think Tesla's pure vision approach can handle the complexities of China's roads, or is LiDAR the safer bet?